role of the Ayush student, what they need to do in the field very clearly and what role they will play when they are supporting interventions at the district level. Second, how they are, what information they are communicating to the uh, areas they will be working in. And especially related to information, as Dr. Tanzin has also talked about, what are the prevention, what are the control measures. If you are looking at social distancing, we are looking at issues related to home home quarantine, etc., all that will also come in. Third thing is the major role where government is seeking support is on the community surveillance and contact tracing. So when you are training um, in a cascade mode to IU students and field workers, this uh, through this um, section, they will be informed in detail how the contact tracing, how the early identification, early reporting of the large clusters will be done. Next slide, please, Varsha. We will also talk or learn in this training about stigma and discrimination. There are, um, uh, you are um, you have access to information, um, what you are seeing it in your areas right now. There are high prevalent of myths and misconceptions related to coronavirus disease and fears related to it. So we will be learning about it in this section, how we can address those myths and misconceptions. Our fifth point would be our fifth section is about how we will be connecting public health services at the community and household level. Our students and field workers will be helping the communities and households about how home quarantine, home care, psychosocial care can be addressed or linked at their level. Last and the most important thing is that when we, when they are in the field, how they will take care about themselves, especially when they are, they are, uh, are uh, engaging with the suspected or, uh, you know, like patients where there could be large clusters, etc. After this training, the, uh, these, uh, the trained students or field level workers should keep yourself in readiness to be deployed further for surveillance if need arises as decided by the district level authorities. Uh, the reporting chain uh, include that uh, these uh, field level workers after surveillance, uh, they will report to their college if they are students or if they are field level workers, they can report to their master trainers or nodal officers who will train them and thereafter this will go to the district IUS officer or district level no surveillance officer whichever is appointed and then they will compile the information from all sources and send it to the district collector so that they, uh, he can deploy it wherever need arises.